Well, the Institute of Mental Health is a virtual institute. It's an umbrella. Uh, it's a space for academics and clinicians and partners to gather together, to share information, to share teaching, to share ideas, uh, hopefully to collaborate so that we can together put all that expertise um, forward to get support from governments and grant giving agencies and, and really do great research, uh, world class research to tackle the problems of mental illness. I think it's important to have the Institute of Mental Health because it does act as a sort of focus, a place to bring together all the, the diverse uh, interest in UCL, it's a huge university, but we cut across neurology, psychology, public health and the arts and it needs somewhere where people can um, interact. So UCL is a real powerhouse of mental health research but as, it, as in many situations it's in, in a number of different places and, and we don't always communicate so effectively across the different specialities, psychiatry, psychology, neurology, neuroscience. So the, the purpose of the Institute is really to bring all of these specialities together and to really encourage people to collaborate and to, to talk to each other. But I, I think also to provide a, a leadership and direction for the, the entire uh, mental health research approach here at UCL. I think it provides opportunity for collaboration, so you get to meet people who you may not have met previously, that are studying similar things or things that are related. And I think that function is very important, especially at a university like UCL, which is so big and divided. It's nice to have a home or a center where people with similar interests can congregate and discuss. I think the Institute has the potential to generate lots of interdisciplinary research on the topic which will give us new approaches, new questions, new methodologies, new ways of addressing problems that have been around for quite some time. What you need to do is to have collaborations across the disciplines. So I think the important thing is to foster accidental mixing and break down the barriers of, uh, of different disciplines. I think for a long time at UCL we've had huge amount of really brilliant research which has happened in silos and I think that there is a real impetus to bring these different research traditions together now and for people to work together to do something that is more than the sum of its parts and I think that the Institute of Mental Health can really facilitate that. I think the Institute needs to think carefully about how it will bring the different groups together, how it will provide events or uh, seminars, lecture series that will bring different groups together, how it will encourage more informal uh, discussion and communication. Uh, just social events are often the most effective way of getting people to talk to each other and realising that actually they're working on quite similar areas and they could collaborate. So again, it's as an enabling, facilitating uh, institute. That's how it will, I hope, will work going forward. Really, I think the Institute of Mental Health has got to capitalise on all of that diversity and uh, breadth of interest and expertise, bring it together, focus it, so together we can really make an impact on uh, people with mental health problems.